estate is a commoditized business. You have to have trust, you have to have great communication, and one of the things I always try to do is to add value. Today, we're at 430 B Street in Salsalito, which you'll see is a completely demoed construction project on an amazing lot. Now, most people walk into a project like this and they don't know what to do. They're kind of like, I love the lot, I love the location, but I'm at a loss as to how to do it, how to finance it, how do I make it all happen? Today, I'll walk you through a couple of ways that you too can do this. So 430B is a fully demoed, gutted project in Salsalito. Now you walk into a place like this and most conventional banks won't loan on a property like this because it's not habitable. However, we've got a few people in our Rolodex, some private banks that will loan on things like this. Now typically you have to have a slightly higher loan to value ratio. You may need to put down 40% versus 20%, but there are banks and there are ways to finance being able to buy a project in this condition and also be able to finance your construction costs, which will roll straight into a more permanent mortgage cost. So in this market, one of the things we're seeing is that buyers wanna buy things that are done. Now, not if you're my buyer. If you're my buyer, I want you to buy something that you can still add value to. But most buyers wanna buy things that are done. So as a seller that wants to maximize your return on investment, you want to make sure that before you sell, your kitchens are great, your bathrooms are great, your paint, your hardwood floors. And a lot of my sellers are putting this money into their home right before they sell. And then they say, Tyler, why didn't I do this while I had the time to live in this nice new kitchen in this bathroom? I think a lot of times it's because people don't understand that you can take out a construction loan just to redo your kitchen and your bathroom for you to enjoy for longer than just before you go to sell it. So as a buyer, I want you to buy looking for value. As a seller, I want you to make sure that we maximize your return on investment. In both cases, a construction loan can be a really good option. 